hi this is a very impromptu live i felt very drawn to making this live and the topic is going to be following your intuitive hits and as you can hear probably there's a bird talking right now and uh being loud um and that's okay because they're probably just just doing their own thing but i wanted to talk about how today like probably you you've been maybe in a kerfuffle maybe you feel not as great as you usually do or that's how i've been feeling i've been feeling a little bit weird i've been feeling like out of place i've been feeling kind of out of alignment hi hello um and usually what that happens is when i'm like i'm not getting a message that i need to be getting that i'm not hearing something that i should actually be hearing so um what happened today was i felt just like not great so i decided to leave the house and take off my fake nails and then just i intuitively followed where like I, my intention was to go get my nails off right and then my intuition led me to a nail place i'd never seen that's like right outside my house and that's just like a mini intuitive hit that helped me get like help a small business right but the one that i want to talk about today and relates to the crow that's talking to me right now is guidance so i oh you're falling um so today i was thinking i was listening to a podcast and then at the end i um my brain was like yeah you should participate in that and it's something that Makosi the royal shaman is hosting and I was like not me who am I to to go in that that's for like businesses that's for people that run their own business like I'm not gonna waste people's time and then I just took some time off blackbird uh I took some time and I was like, actually, no, my intuition is actually trying to tell me right now to participate in her complimentary call. Even though so many blackbirds all around right now. Um, and as I was like, OK, you know what? Maybe I should do this. And I took some time to meditate on it because I have so many things that like I'm like confused about. And so I went into my backyard and I sat down on an like on this gift that um, my beautiful boy got me. And I listened to frequency music. And I just kind of meditated I just sat down and I just listened to the music and I started to ask for guidance so kind of this is turning into a step-by-step -step how to but so you saw me get this journal the other day so what I like to do is when I'm seeking answers and when I'm asking the universe for answers be ready be ready to write them down be ready to kind of I find it like then I can transcribe so if I'm asking something I could write it along or I could just be in state of meditation and then remember what they were saying right afterwards so I just have my notebook open and right after it finishes like after I feel like I should like open my eyes I just write down what the answers to my questions just to get some clarity on what I should be doing what I shouldn't be doing um and how to step into this new version of who I am and who I want to be and so that's been a process and I felt kind of clouded I felt like I don't know the past few days where I'm supposed to be how I'm supposed to be uh like how am I supposed to be showing up what am I supposed to be doing right now like I I've I've definitely been asking my fair share of questions and so um with that, I, I asked the question, I was like, should I do Makosi's thing? While I was just like in a very like, 
like state where I'm not listening to anybody else. There's nobody else around me except for the blackbirds, and they'll come into play like in two seconds. But um, I heard, like I just I felt like it was a yes. A yes felt right for me. So I decided to um to take that advice, and I was like, I'm gonna do it right now. I grabbed my phone. I started typing in my information so that I could uh, do something uh, tomorrow. And finally enough, as I was putting in my information, like two or three, I think two blackbirds, which one is looking at me right now, um, started kind of circling me or like passing like right by me. And blackbirds, for those who don't know, are connected to shamanism. And Makosi is the royal shaman. So that was like a hella confirmation of, yeah, you are actually supposed to be doing this. I don't fully know. I mean, I feel like I'm going to get a lot out of it. I do. Uh, Sometimes I still hear my brain being like, but like, what do you, like who, like you're not in that place yet, but fuck that. Like, I'm not going to let that start ruling me. Um... So I did that, and the only time that they had tomorrow was the time that I had booked earlier in the week at another appointment, and my brain was like, just choose it, just choose it, and I was like, okay, I choose it, and then I called the other people, and they didn't mind me coming in late. So follow your intuitive hits, because, like, things are going to work out around them. The universe doesn't care that you have another appointment. Um, because it knows that everything's going to work out in the end. And it just wants you to be able to follow your instincts and follow your gut and follow your heart so that you can do this. And I feel way lighter now. I felt like my brain was so clouded before. But honestly, taking the time to come into just the grass and just sit down and just chill has been really helpful for me. And I don't feel as like constricted or um or like my brain is all fuzzy so yeah that's <laughs> basically all that I wanted to say your intuitive hits can come in many different ways I always share with you mine because we're in this beginning process of how to do this what is an intuitive hit how do intuitive hits happen how what are not intuitive hits you know so I decided that I, I need to be able to share this information because I know that for me, I kind of sometimes need that validation of, yeah, things can happen in these mini forms or in these really big forms. So thank you so much for watching. I know most of you are on IGTV right now, so um, like it. This will probably be up on the new and improved 20verse YouTube channel. And I, it's just going to be a short if you like watching videos like this on YouTube instead. Or it's going to be on the IGTV as always as you're probably watching this. So subscribe if you're on YouTube. Uh, like it in either. And I'm excited to hear from you. And a new podcast comes out this week. So get excited. Bye.